Our next router tip is, uh, the winds are so much stronger that, than I'm used to. If I had a dime for every time that an applicant blamed the winds as a reason for their poor performance, I would encourage the applicants to uh, fly with their instructors on the windy days and the gusty days. I know it's easy to cancel on those days, but if check ride day happens to be a little windier day, they really can't be using the winds as an excuse for their poor performance. And I've seen that from time to time. And as helicopter pilots, we can use the winds uh, to our favor uh, for some of the tasks that are going to be conducted that day. I'll talk to an instructors right here. If if you feel the winds are really gusty and you know maybe uh, severe, too strong, yeah, it's okay to cancel that. What I'm talking about is don't be afraid to fly in those days where the winds are gusting up over 20 knots because there probably will be a day that your student is going to have to fly in conditions like that. So it's important to fly in all types of weather conditions. The winds are much stronger than I'm used to. Keep that in mind, instructors, and let's try to fly with the students, even on some of the windier days. Rotor Tips, brought to you by Helicopter Online Ground School's No-Go Decision Button. When you feel the pressure to fly, but know the right decision is to stay on the ground, hit the hogs, no-go, and live to fly another day.